change, as news of a new kid spreads throughout the land. In order to save the humans, the Grand Wizard must get to the new kid. Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome back to another South Park Phone Story video. This is my third video today. I think I've done four now, actually, but uh, this is my third part because they're quite easy to finish, so I'm going to kind of uh, rush through them because I don't want to get spoiled on what's to come. But uh, yeah, so the last episode, or an hour ago for me, we saw Professor Chaos, which was a huge surprise. Uh, his card art was amazing. And uh, today we are doing, well, for, for the first task, for the first clue, we have to play eight neutral themes. Uh, we have to do nine characters in single player and use seven mystical theme units in a single player mode. So let's uh, breathe through this to see what the next character is. Maybe General Desiree? I don't know. They did just show Professor Chaos. So maybe they might show some more new characters. I don't know, but let's try and finish this quick. Okay, so with the next one, we have to defeat five fantasy theme units in a uh, pvp and we've just done some of the progress on the other ones so it's uh pretty easy but the next one we are doing will be pvp for some fantasy units okay so now we've done um all the pve content we now have to go over to fantasy so we're going to switch back to our, our normal deck which is mainly consists of fantasy units um but however we do have to kill them so it might be a bit long because you know fantasy is a uh, I mean, it's it's used, but it's not always used. Okay, so that's finally done. Honestly, it took quite a while. Uh, no one's really using fantasy cards. Uh, that looks like human kite. That's, I'm pretty sure that's his little arm with the kite. Uh, anyway, we have to play four epics, which is fine. And then... Okay, so it looks like we have to play four epic cards in PvP. That's fine. We do that anyway. Play eight kids in PvP, again, easily. And play eight Indians in single player. Uh, we've already done that challenge, so we know what it's about. Okay, so we've done the two easy ones for PvP, and then now we have to defeat eight female units in single player mode. So I've said it in my last video, just defeat the females, just go to stage three, um, episode three, stage three, which is uh, one where you vs Alien Queen Red, because for some reason you get six for defeating her, so that's pretty easy. Okay, so clue two, it does look like to be Human Kite, and we have to defeat nine female units in single player. Uh, that's We've gotten that quite a lot, actually. Uh, play six flying units, easy, and play nine mystical so the mystical does have like i think him tweak uh there are quite there's not quite a lot of flying units right um let's go check okay so okay so him tweak uh we have oh pigeons count a uh, star of marvin count um terran festo so we're just gonna throw in the deck and just pretty much finish the challenge pretty quick okay so uh, like i said i've defeated stage three episode three uh, the flying units and the females, so that's two done. And then also we did the mystical theme because, I mean, I pretty much use mystical with token and stuff. So that's three challenges in one go. We have one task left, so which is that play nine comments in single player. Uh, another easy one. Okay, so we've done stage three or clue three. Now we have to play nine themes, uh, fantasy themes in single player. Oh, again, easy. Play uh, seven characters in PvP and play four epics in single player. Okay, so we've done the epics and play fantasy. So now we have to defeat nine sci-fi theme units and play seven characters. I did seven characters last in PvP because that's pretty much to play one game. Okay, so I've just finished PvP. Uh, like I said, it was to play seven characters in PvP. So that's pretty much to play one game. Uh, this should be the fourth clue now. So we are going to get our cutscene. So I'm going to plug in my earphones and so you can hear the sound. And hopefully we get some juicy content. With the cutscenes. Alright, so it is the human kite. He arch pretty good, not gonna lie. Alright, here we go. So, okay, so Wendy's calling this time. We turn the sound up. New kid, this is Call Girl. I've been monitoring social media and I think maybe you're being taken advantage of. I am. Eric Cartman is trying to sell you his legendary card, isn't he? Yeah, well, he is. there's something <laughs> you should know. Last week, Cartman. Oh, all right, Car Carmen's calling this time, what the hell? New kid! New kid, something's happening! There's been a rip in, in space time! The multiverse has opened up, and one of the superheroes has been replaced by their evil twin. Oh, I think I know okay. who it is! Get to my mark right away! Casey <laughs> Lynn! What was that? All right, the, the multiverse? I mean, that opens up some possibility for some cards. That's, that's not, that's pretty cool. However, I do think this, this theme is full enough of um, normal superhero cards, so I don't think we're going to get any multiverse um, version of cards. 
So let's actually start this boss fight. Normally this ain't that hard, but uh, I still want to record it just for the playthrough. Bro, I can't stress enough how much I love that new wallpaper. Especially one or two in the top right. That he's going to be an amazing card. Okay, so human kite. Okay, I am the human kite. The wind is my ally. Alright. How can I assist you, my friend? Oh, Karma's with us this time. You're in your wrong universe, Kai. Time to die. What are you talking about, Cartman? Alright, well, we have our good deck. Okay, we can't spawn Ikin. Alright, let's go with... Okay, let's spawn in... Okay, let's spawn in Butters on the Craig. Wait, how is he spawning in two Craigs? Alright, well, this is another easy one, actually. Um, do I wish there were more... A lot of, oh, no, I don't know, because... To be fair, level 5 epic. Um, if it was harder, then... I guess more people won't be able to finish it, because they are supposed to be quite easy, so you get a free legendary at the end. But I do enjoy playing these, though. They are quite fun. I was expecting to get uh, the normal what it was before, where they add stages, which I still think they can do. Because um, they can't really add stages if they don't have all the cards in. Because you know me first, every every time you do a new stage, you burst a new fire. Which um, which I kind of hope they uh, do in the future. Okay, there we go. Human Kite, one epic. It's a bit weird how we didn't get... Um... Anything last time. Okay, so not decent rewards. I do like the three epics, they're not bad. Oh, that's disgusting. Four hours. Alright, well, there we go. This is going to be the Human Kite episode. Um, I, it looks like to be a lot more to come, so stay tuned. Uh, we upload in, I think, at least two a day. Um, I'm going to pretty much stop. Maybe do one more later on. But thank you guys for watching, and peace.